Hey everybody, uh, this week I'm going to do a little video for you on Old Spice body washes. So, if you're into Old Spice body washes like me, then you pretty well know that for a long time now they've had quite a good arsenal of different body washes on a number of different ones and spins on some good different fragrances. And uh, right now I'd like to do a little bit of a video on the three of them that I particularly like and that I try to keep in my arsenal here in my bathroom and in my shower as much as I can. I only personally use one of them at a time. I'm weird that way. I like to start with one, finish it, and then go on to a new one. I don't keep numerous body washes in my shower. I know some people that do just so they can switch it up a little bit. I don't do that. Uh, real quickly, I'd just like to start off with some of the ones that I use. I got a huge thing here full of shaving stuff, body washes, toiletries, and stuff. Most of the stuff I haven't even used yet. But the other day, I just got these three Old Spice body washes. And in this mix, I have razors, beard oil, aftershaves, body sprays, colognes. Uh, beard oils, beard softeners, beard waxes. Anyway, I'm going to talk about all three of these uh, body washes a little bit. And the first one I'd like to do today is the Old Spice Swagger, which is most of you who've used any of the Old Spices, for a lot of guys, this is a go-to. A lot of guys who've been using this pretty regularly and they know a lot about it. It smells really good. Just open the fragrant and just open the bottle here. Now it's got a pretty typical fragrance. It's not uh it's not particularly overly cologne-y like a man's cologne. So it's gonna appeal to those younger people who are looking for a good clean scent. It has that well enough. At least I feel like it does. If you're if that's the way that you're looking to go, it has that. It's a you know it's been on the market really since Old Spice first started doing body washes back in I don't know. I first remember Old Spice coming out with body washes and Axe and all that becoming a big deal when I was in high school. It was right around 2004, 2005 or so. Axe really caught on as kind of a ladies' man shampoo that, you know, their advertisements about how all the girls at the club would be rubbing all over you if you wore that shit. You know, yeah, okay, that get, ad gets a little old after a while, but, you know, here it says on Swagger, body wash for, uh, from Old Spices for the man who holds the complete works of Aristotle in one hand and a delicious sandwich in the other. Swagger's subtle scent transforms your skin to feel like a smooth and hydrated playing field where confidence scores the winning touchdown. No a typical Old Spice marketing campaign, but the, the scent's pretty good. And I got this one... You know, my mom always gets me one of those Old Spice gift kits for Christmas that comes with, you know, a couple bottles of sham of uh, body wash, maybe a travel size one, some body spray, and a deodorant. The next one I want to move on to, this was one that I actually just ordered on Amazon. Well, no, actually, I got it off of Walmart.com. It's the Old Spice Classic. So... If you're about my age and, you know, your dad or your grandfather probably had Old Spice cologne in there, you know, that they wore. It was probably at least in the vanity in the bathroom and it smelled something. You probably remember something that looks a lot like this. It smells just like that. And while I don't like this in a cologne, I just keep it for a novelty actually because I like the way the bottle looks. An Old Spice bottle looks, it's just, it's classic, it's recognizable. I don't wear it. Love my grandfather, but don't want to smell like that. Uh, you know, I just keep it for looks. But the body wash 
I actually like the way that smells in a body wash. A nice manly body wash. That an Old Spice, how do they go about it? They say, if your grandfather hadn't worn it, you wouldn't exist. I'm saying that you're a real man if you if, if you wear this, you know. Uh, that, I, you know, I used to see this in stores about 10 years or so ago. It was several years after Axe and Old Spice body washes became a really big deal. They stopped carrying it in stores. Don't ask me why. I personally loved it. But I don't know what happened. It probably didn't sell well. I'm not even sure how to pronounce this last one. As you can see, it's Kronkengard or something like that. And it shows a picture of a little, uh, like an octopus on there. I don't even know what to think about that. Nothing combats body smells and skin dirt like turtle doves, but those didn't test well in focus groups, so we went with a giant sea mo monster instead. Scrub your man suit clean with the power of Krankengard, preferred two to one over turtle doves. And uh, just give it a good smell. A little bit stronger than the swagger, but it's a typical... Newer body wash. It's not the super manly. If you've used Edge Shave Gel, something that looks quite a lot like this, and you know what that smells like, real kind of fruity, not super masculine like shaving creams do. It's about like that, as best I can describe it. All right, that's my video on... Old Spice Body Washes for this week. Hope to talk more about that with you. Stay tuned for more, everybody. Thanks.